Hey there, it's Bill Deweese from voiceoverrevolution.com. And a question that I'm frequently asked is, if I receive a script from a client that has mistakes, like grammatical mistakes or things that are obviously not supposed to be there, should I record as is or should I correct? It's a really good question. And the answer is really, it depends. You've got to find out what the client wants. And here's the best way to do that that I found. The first time I receive a script from a client with a mistake, what I will do is I will correct that mistake on the fly. If it's a grammatical error, I'll correct it. If it's improper usage of a word, I'll, I'll correct it, whatever, whatever the, the case may be. After I record it, and here's the important part, when you send the uh, project back to the client, note for them what you did and the changes that you made and the reason why you did that. Um, that way they're not surprised when they see it. They understand your intent and what, what you were doing. There will be two results to that. One is, A, they will be thrilled and see that as a value-added thing and that you're part of the team and you're really trying to help. B, they won't want you to correct those, and they'll let you know that, but they'll know that you were at least trying to help them out. And if they say, and you may be thinking, really, clients don't want you sometimes to correct mistakes? Yes, especially when it comes from, my experience has been, when it's coming from a uh, writer that does not speak English as a first language. And oftentimes, and I have clients, this is the case, if I make the correction on the fly, it will be sent back to me to correct to the incorrect version. So as silly as it may seem, that's just the way it works. But by explaining to the client the first time that you do it, why you're doing it and what the mistake was, they will view you as somebody who's really trying to be helpful. So, uh, and then you just simply follow their lead. However they instruct you, that's what you do going forward. So hope you find that suggestion helpful. It's all about creating better long-term relationships for your clients, which is great for the client and certainly more profitable for you in the long haul. So thanks for checking out the video. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and I'll talk to you again very soon.